So this is the the uh, video from the rear facing camera that I installed in the Marshmallow. Um, this is in uh, normal normal mode, not speeded up or anything, and no color enhancement or anything like that. Says I don't know how to do that stuff. And uh, I think this is a pretty fantastic system for the price. Uh, like I said, it's only about two hundred dollars and it has both cameras and it records from both cameras at all times. This is now from the front facing camera and this is at, uh, I don't know, I think 500 times speed and I've taken every other five seconds of video out uh, just to get through it quicker. It records in three minute increments and now this is the exact same section of road uh, but now from the rear view or rear facing camera. So again, I think the system is pretty great. I'm pretty impressed with it and uh, glad I have it. Good morning. It is Friday, July 19th. And I pulled this out of the room over the garage. <clears throat> this is a panel my daughter painted in a uh, scenic design class in, when she was in college. And it's just been up in the room of the garage for ages. And um, she just wanted to throw it out. But I wanted to keep it. I didn't know why. But I am going to use it for the sliding doors on the dresser cabinet. And probably use some of it somewhere else as well. So I need to go get the... Um, I need to go up to the barn and get the rails off the last of the uh, IKEA cabinets I got from work. And and mount those on the uh, dresser cabinet and then I can cut these panels. So I got a microphone but the ones that are like Bluetooth are like 135 and up so I'm not gonna spend that much money on it so I just bought a cheap one that clips on with a little extension cord to it. Um, not sure how well this is gonna work but it's got to be better than what I was doing. Um, as you see I'm all covered up I am currently taking a medication that I cannot be out in the sun or not let direct sunlight on my skin. That's for 10 days. I'm not sure how well that's going to turn out either. But anyway, All right, I'm about to make the first cut on this. I'm a little nervous about it. And I hope I don't cut my mic cord. There are the two doors. I will sand the edges up and then I will put a coat of polyurethane on them. Um, sort of protect them if I can. The doors cut for the dresser cabinet and two coats of polyurethane on them and the little finger holes cut. I put these in the middle. Um, you've seen my other video with the sink cabinet. <coughs> I had them at the top and I found that that's not very good because they end up sort of lifting on one end and then they're harder to push to the side. Some decent ratchet straps and uh, I've just put them over the whole thing, so all the way from the back of the fridge up through this slot, which ended up being a bonus, actually, my mistake. <laughs> and uh, so they go up from there and all the way over the stove and down to the front of the fridge drawer. And that's all I'm going to do for tonight. Um, it's wicked hot today, in the mid to upper 90s. It's supposed to be over 100 tomorrow. Um, so I don't know how much I'll get done tomorrow. Um, I ordered a head unit and it came in today. Um, 
I might try to install that tomorrow, but I don't have the little things to remove the original radio, so I'm not sure I'm going to be able to get that out. Uh, I, I did order a kit that includes that, because um, it's got the faceplate and the brackets and the wiring harness and the removal tool. But come to find out the head unit I ordered actually comes with the bracket and the wiring harness and all that, so I don't need the kit that I ordered. So I'll just send that back. But anyway, I might see if anyone around here has um, the removal tool for the wire or for the radio. And uh, if they do, then I'll try to remove, uh, remove that tomorrow and install the head unit. Okay, I'm going to wrap this video up. And thanks very much for watching. Have a great evening. Stay cool wherever you are because it's like impossible to stay cool here. Um, I don't have air conditioning in the house because Lord knows we don't need it very often. But when we do, it's I feel like I'm going to die. <laughs> I hate the heat. All right. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>